Hey guys, <clears throat> what's up? I just wanted to get on here real quick and give you some life updates and a big announcement. Um, I'm sure a lot of you guys have noticed that some of my training has slowed down and some of my classes have also slowed down. And there's a reason for that, you know, there's been a lot going on. Um, but I just wanted to let you guys know that I am currently expecting my first. Yes, I am pregnant. I am today 21 weeks pregnant, actually. So I'm a little bit more than halfway there. So that's pretty cool. Um, I wanted to make this announcement because, you know, it's getting to the point where I'm starting to show and people are asking me questions. And, you know, I'm just ready to announce it. So, you know, I've had quite a few people... <laughs> you know, send me messages on Instagram and stuff saying, you know, are you pregnant and stuff like that. And uh, so that's pretty funny because, you know, when, when you don't know, you people feel bad asking. But yes, I am pregnant and this is my first time being pregnant and um, this is a new journey for me. And um, as far as my channel, it doesn't mean that I'm not going to be American Gun Chick or I'm not going to still train or upload or do classes or anything like that. Um, but as far as being around firearms and the noise and all that stuff, because, you know, that's something that people have asked me, hey, so can you still go shooting while being pregnant? So the answer to that is yes and no. So I can't be around live fire for very long. So what I'm doing is I'm avoiding being around uh, gunfire as much as possible and just staying away from the range. and. I'm using my Mantis X actually to do a lot of dry fire and so I can still practice and I'm not losing my fundamentals and all of my skills and stuff that I've built up uh, and that way I'm not doing any of that for nine months. So yeah, I've been doing that. Um, I just finished off one of my last classes um, in Lexington and that was my final class that I will be participating in. You know, we might still be able to do classes as long as I'm not on the firing line and I'm away during that part um, but you know that it gets to a point where how far along you become you can't really be around that stuff so you know no indoor ranges because of the lead around in the air and you know can't be around live fire for too long and yeah so basically that's what's going on um, it doesn't mean that after the baby comes that I won't get back to all these classes and I'll be super excited to get back to all these classes and back to training, you know, I haven't taken any classes and I won't take any classes until after the baby comes. So that's what's going on with that. Um, yeah, and as far as everything else, you know, I'm still gonna upload. I'm still going to upload on Patreon. I already announced it on Patreon a couple days ago uh, because I always do my announcements and they always get the first scoop of my life basically over there. So if you're not following me on Patreon, go check out my Patreon. Um, but yeah, it's pretty exciting. Um, actually, funny story is, forgot I wanted to mention this, is I actually found out in the team room at Tactical Response. So what's funny about that is I was out there. I actually found out um, when I was out traveling around the time of June. So I remember it was the end of June and I just finished doing a low light class at Tactical Response. We actually showed up and I did um, Force on Force. I was an actor for Force on Force, did a medical class then did a low light class. And after that, I, you know, felt like it was kind of weird that I was kind of late. And so I was like, that's kind of weird. So I went and got a test and took it back to the team room, took it at the team room and found out right then and there. So that was crazy, <laughs> you know, because you, if, you, if you've ever been to the team room at Tactical Response, you know that there's people coming and going constantly and it's filled with dudes. So it's not like there's other girls there that you can talk to or anything like that. So. You know, I kind of saw that and I kind of kept it to myself and um, just went about my business. I was done with all my classes, so that was good. And then just went back on the road and eventually went back home. So um, yeah, actually my due date is in February. I'm due February 23rd, so 2 2 3, uh, 2022. That's a lot of twos. But yeah, so I'm super excited. Um, I'm probably going to do a not a gender reveal, but a gender announcement video. So stay tuned for that. And if you guys have any kids that are watching this, I'm sure a lot of you guys do, or if you're currently pregnant or, or a woman watching this and has had kids, leave some advice down below or, or just let me know what you think, you know, because this is a completely new journey for me. Something that is completely different than the firearms world. And it's something new and I've been learning a lot. I've been doing a lot of research and going to the doctor 
and trying to learn as much as I can. You know, I know what I'm not supposed to do and what I'm supposed to do and all, all that stuff, but there's a, a lot to know and to learn. So yeah, so there will be a little ba mini baby AGC coming February. And I just wanted to let you guys know, um, I'm super excited and yeah, that's all I want to say. Thank you for watching this video. I'll keep you guys updated. And if you guys don't want to hear that much about pregnancy stuff, I understand this is a gun channel, but let me know what you want to know. And I'm uploading a lot of stuff on my Patreon about specifically the pregnancy stuff, but yeah, I will talk to you guys later and hope you have a good day.